cop director said, what did you say? He said, me? I said, no quiero Taco Bell. They rewind the tape, they realize he said, no quiero Taco Bell. Boom, goes out, never to be seen again. Hey guys, before we start the video, make sure you guys go check out my gaming channel, show some love, subscribe, at Loha Games. I was trying to center myself. Oh, okay. I don't know what that means, but All I right. saw it in a movie. Sure, sure. You're, you're, you're transcending. Right. You're transcending into a, into a lower being. There we go. Can you transcend to a lower being or ascend? Imagine I did that and you saw me kind of glide. Oh, like you a elevate? Oh, that would have been nice. <laughs> what up, guys? Upside down. Have you ever put a pants for your shirt in a shirt for your pants? Never happened to you? Me neither. Kind of happened to me in my dreams. What up, people? <laughs> what up? <laughs> Man. Yeah, that's right. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. Okay. You guys requested this. 10 cute animals that can kill. Oh, I'm down for cute animals. What? Adorable, cute, snuggly Aww. animals. But sometimes Aww. those fluffy, squishy creatures Sorry, just don't love us back. For this Ooh. installment, we're going to ruin your image of some of Mother Nature's most oh, no, I don't know cute animals that may wind up killing you before oh, no. showing you any affection. No, no, no. Number 10, panda bear. That's true. You've probably seen that's those my, videos that's my of right. I mean, panda bears tumbling That's from true, Eric. That can't kill me. Helpless can't kill me. What? You just want to rush to their fluffy little can't side, kill. scoop them up, and heal their what? wounds. What? It doesn't, that. it's not called a bear for the reason, Eric. You'll make your ass of them boo, son. Why do you gotta scream in my oh, ears, man? No, no, I'm sorry. You're right. Or if they feel threatened. Sure, you got four teeth? I'm good. That, that, bear, that bear ain't gonna kill me. There's no way. Four teeth. If I least you have five. ran into the farm of Guan Xin Chi and took a man's leg between its powerful jaws. Oh, what do you think? survived the attack, but this is only one example. Oh, you never heard the song called Pinda? There's something you're fascinating about oh. elephants on the outside. Well, we know the like spoiler ass. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Dopey animals, as seen with Dumbo. Yeah, but yeah. elephants are pretty cool though. If they know you, they're friends with you. They don't, they don't do nothing to you. You've never seen the protector? They're very loyal. Right, you're right. There was you remember what, what uh, these uh, elephants ain't loyal? Damn, look at the dog on that. 54 We're looking at his dog. I just saw it. An there. incident in Balaton Village in eastern India in 2013 was believed to be an orchestrated revenge attack by a herd of 15 elephants. After one wow. was killed by a passenger train. I think I was the unlucky to have 15 elephants uh, stampede on it. Before rampaging into the village. Oh my what God. the hell did he do? Oh, we, I know that one would, would chop your ass. Jaws right there. Rack. 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 Speeding towards you, bringing with it an appetite. You ever see the flesh. teeth on them? Oh my God. While the only recorded death by sea leopard occurred no in 2003, when biologist Kirsty Brown was dragged 200 feet or yeah, I've seen that exact video. Right that's not a cute animal, though. They're talking about cute animals. Very, How's that cute? Display of oh, no, aggressive behavior, right. especially towards black pontoons and inflatable boats. Other attacks on humans include Thomas Ward Lee's and Scottish explorer Gareth Wood. I've seen that video, right? Exact video. Death. Seals are also known to toy with penguins, chasing them around. Yeah, yeah. No penguins? The That's what they eat, Eric. Ends when the penguin escapes or what they dies eat. from exhaustion. Number seven, dolphins. Oh, I didn't know that one. They may have saved the day in Jaws 3, dolphins? but there's nothing heroic about these endearing marine mammals. What do you say? Along with humans, bottlenose dolphins are one of the only other species known to kill for no reason. Though that They don't kill people, though. They to cause an outbreak of dead swimmers. That's what? not to say they haven't had the taste of human flesh in the past. As an attack in Brazil in 1994 left one man dead and another with a broken rib. Dolphins? Another man off of Shirk and Yo, that must have been a shark in disguise, man. I'm not going to believe you. Water by a I'm not going to believe you. Nope. Was lashing out. Number six. Listen, man. I'm sorry, bro. You never seen that movie, Dos Bigolo? Octopus. Ah, finally. Some uh, cute. Okay, that ain't cute, guys. Octopus says no. The blue ringed octopus is a cute octopi. How do you know octopus and pearl? Blue octopi. Rings all yeah. over its body. I think. You pretend you know. In the Pacific that was one of the most dangerous this ever, by the way. We were so dumb in English. carry enough venom to kill 26 full grown adults in minutes. You got minutes. that right. Even worse than that is if you're bitten by them, you may not even know it until the effects start to set until in. Until you die, you won't know about respiratory depression, heart failure, total paralysis, and What do you think? It's death. venom. I the told you. I need some venom. Is rare, and only three reported deaths have occurred. 
Number five, poison yeah, dart. Uh, uh, you know, Thanks to scientific. I don't know about it and their cute or not. We eat little amphibians. This is cute, more Come surprise. on, look how cute, there man. There are different types of poison dart frogs. Look how cute. Man. This is like literally oh, mucus oh, alive. That's what? It's mucus. Like, look at it. The golden poison dart oh, okay. frog, known to have another. Yeah, come on. If you squint your eyes a little bit, I see how cute. Cute. What I don't like about them, their legs are always spread. Creatures spread it like they never close their legs. Are secreted through skin glands. Curiously, poison Look. dart frogs raised in captivity don't show signs of toxicity. They That's what they eat. Believe that the that frog makes them secrete a deadly mix from its prey, such You're as ants right and mites, which are okay. likely to be carrying plant toxins. There you go. Number four, pufferfish. Oh, okay. Pufferfish, I don't, I don't mind those. In the deep blue. I can't but believe they eat that in, in Japan. The yes, they eat. Uh, in Japan, they kind of eat everything. Seems to be at its deadliest after it is dead. And turned into a popular Japanese dish, fugu. You heard? While still fugu, alive, you know, more dangerous when it's dead. That is used yeah. For Get stung by one of these tetrahodonidae, and you're likely to have a bad mm. final day alive. <laughs> the chances about being are stung, this is how you'll become intoxicated. Instead, it's more likely that a human will die from a puffer after it has been killed, mostly due to poor preparation. Because yeah, you're gonna eat it. So why would I go to a restaurant and buy this? Poison. That's not like gross. Because yeah. apparently, um, people eat it because it gives you a sensation. Like it's like it's like it's like it's like playing Russian roulette. You know, right. it's like it's like uh, adrenaline right. when you eat it. It gives you a little numbing effect. All right, I'm, I'm you know, good. I, I makes. I guess it makes a dog man, I'm, good with, I'm good with salmon, man. Salmon or something like that, or tilapia or something like that. You know what fugu would be good? Right. It would be a a great food for somebody on death row. Imagine their last meal. Right. You ask for some fugu. You know you're gonna die anyway. Right. Right. Give me some fugu. At least I'll die with a bang. Cause I'm gonna have a hard on and I'm dying. <laughs> vomit, suffer muscle paralysis, rapid heart rate, and an inability to breathe. Mortality rate is said to be between 10 to 50 percent, mm. depending on sources. And that fool who's messing with no you, bro? Antidote. Number three, slow loris. Yes, oh. they're so yes. cute that it's oh. yeah, a little nil right do here. Want a little... to take home one of these wide-eyed nocturnal primates? This could kill me. So would be potentially Listen. putting your life at risk. Despite being illegal, right there, you see him be gripping on people. Or you see his eyes. Also, extremely deadly, <clears throat> and is known as being the most poisonous mammals in the world. Okay, right? the loris releases a toxin. You know what? Its elbows. Elbow. Places, Sorry. It so he has to do this. So he's give you. He's gonna give you one of them elbow elbow punches. That can lead to envenomation. He's gonna give you an elbow and kill you. Yeah. Even stranger. In 2013, researchers hypothesized that the loris has evolved over time to mimic cobras. From hissing Damn. to defensive wow. swaying motion. Damn. Number two. Chip. Oh, chip. 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 Whether or not well, we know they could rip grass to pieces, right? They ain't and, cute. They, they, I know they could rip their shit off and throw it to tall grass, but uh, but they're not cute. They're, right, right. They're, right. they're cute when they're kids. Creatures. Right. In their natural habitat, chimps are believed to be naturally aggressive, a trait that for some reason they like ripping your nose off. Right. Domesticated. As You've seen pack, what they did? Like the well-known 2009 mutilation of Charlotte Nash. What did I tell you? Oh, 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 shows these belligerent humanoids can be unpredictable and highly dangerous. See, we're here making jokes face and hands during an attack number one what dogs. sorry yeah, wait, he said sorry Canine sorry what lovers but according to the cold hard facts an estimated four and a half you million better not say some shit about pit bulls in states alone fall victim to dog attacks of those about 20 or 30 result in fatality so the next time you're snuggling up with dear sweet maxwell just Yo, this guy this, this guy just got in my nerves right this guy needs to get fired the bro. there's no way strike Okay, no, but that's true. Okay, Making fun of puppies? Down. That's true what he said. Dogs aren't naturally deadly, but they are also not entirely innocent. Whether provoked, rabid, trained, or just protecting their pits. family, dogs right. can strike and do I mean, some serious Can they put humans, humans as, part, as part of it too? Because I think humans should be number one. Right. Because humans are cute sometimes and, and they kill people. Though, don't discount the super fluffy chow chows and huskies. Yeah, yeah. yeah. At the end of the day, Eric, anything with a teeth and a dong can kill you. And a dong? Yeah. Think about it. Any animal that can kill you has a has can teeth you kill somebody with and a has dong. a dong. Okay. I'm what the hell is that? What is that? What is that? You see them chicks? That's isn't that scary? That should be for the next video. I like to do this one. Yeah, don't tell them about it. Oh yeah, yeah, I ain't gonna tell them. Gotta stay tuned. My favorite part of this video is the part where you said that the one that gives you a dong, like a hard <laughs> dong. Because that when I'm picturing me going hard on Rihanna right now, like looped up to the max. I don't even know why. By the way, you remember the dog that used to say, Yo quiero Taco Bell? Yeah, why are I used to, I used to think, I, I think, you know what happened to it? 
One day he made a video and he said, No quiero Taco Bell. So instead of saying yo quiero, right? But what explain to the non speak non Spanish speakers, guys? If you guys know about this puppy, I think his name was Roberto. Roberto, he was Mexican or something like that. He used to make Why a you commercial. Be Mexican, Eric? Because because he had to be a oh, Mexican. Taco Bell, Taco, Taco Bell, Bell, right? right. He was, yo, he used to go out there every 5th of, of May. He used to make a lot of commercials for, for, for tacos, for uh, 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 burritos, for uh, what's the other one I like? The some quesadillas. Chi some chimbales. Some you know? chimbales. Some chimbales. You know. Yeah, muy chingong, so, you know? Right. So then, this boy, man, and it, guys, it's a real puppy who was trained to talk. He actually was the first puppy that ever talked. I don't know if you know that. All movies after this that they made of puppies talking. What's after Roberto? Eric, it's 14 minutes. Listen, home, Roberto will go, Yo quiero Taco Bell. Yo quiero. And for they will the try. For the non Spanish speaking people, right. Yo quiero, Y O means I want. They know, man. If you don't know how to say Yo quiero, when you see a hot female walking by, you say Yo quiero, you know you gotta say it. I don't even know why I'm going to say Anyways, guys. So, the puppy goes, Yo quiero Taco Bell. Yo quiero Taco Bell. Yo quiero. So one day, apparently, he ended up eating a burrito that was too burrito for him. And his next video, by mistake, he said, No quiero Taco Bell. Cut! Director said, What did you say? He said, Me? I said, No quiero Taco Bell. They rewind the tape, they realize he said, No quiero Taco Bell. Boom! <laughs> goes out, never to be seen again. Apparently, now they're recruiting Geico from the Geico commercials. I haven't seen that little shit no more either. Cause what happened to him? He's been auditioning, man. Thanks for watching, guys. Don't forget to subscribe, share, thumbs up, and we'll see you next time. You All right, I'm out of here. You can... Enough this shit. Mark! Mark! Rawr! Rawr!